People often come in and ask about the right shape uh, and size of lampshade for their lamps. And what we're trying to say here is that you're trying to show off the lamp to the best of its ability. The shade is really the accessory to the whole uh, concept of the item as a whole. So what we want for it to be is a harmonious match. Rather like this one here, for example. Of course, we think it's a harmonious match. Someone else might not think so. But uh, we like that. And a, a reasonable way of, of doing this, achieving this look, is the width and the height. If you can achieve that square of the width and the height, often you'll get a, a reasonable balance. So here's another shade, the same as this one. And if I put this up to this here, you can see that it's almost the same height as it is the width. And then you're going to get something which has got a reasonable balance. In the same respect, we can show you this one here, which is the classical blue and white. So once again, it's slightly taller, smaller, but we've achieved the same look, but the width is going to be the same as the height. So we've got that working like that. It's not going to work all the time, because sometimes you're going to have like a candlestick or a very tall lamp. So if we show you this one here, which is a sort of a candlestick, our olive table lamp, you can see that we've chosen a very small shade here, because we're trying to show off the lamp to the best of its ability, and we don't want to overshade the, the lamp. Also, we've got some decoration on the top here, so a shade that would be too heavy in width would potentially lose the decoration. So if I just pick up this previous shade, and I reckon it's about the same height as this one is here, which it is, that's about the same sort of height, and if we apply those previous rules by putting that onto there, you're probably going to think that's too heavy, and I certainly agree with you there. You've already got something, you've got a lot of lamp shade, very little lamp. You can't see the detail of the lamp that you're buying as well. So it's nice and neat. It also increases the sort of the elegance aspect of the item and a bit of the economy of the space around it. When we talk about showing off the lamp base, which is really what we're trying to do, one that works well for us in many locations is an oval lampshade. It's quite a contemporary look, the oval lampshade, and it's useful in a couple of ways. First of all, it doesn't take up so much space being oval. It has the look of a standard lampshade from the front, so that's to say that it shows well in proportion. But if you've got something quite squat like this lamp here, if you put the oval on it, because it hasn't got the overhang, and here we can see it on the side profile, you're not going to lose any of the lamp underneath. And obviously something like this is going to be really useful on a bedside cabinet, on a console table, or somewhere where you're a bit short on space.